Hi, I'm Sarah. Welcome to The Daily English Show. Today we're studying a scene from a movie called Goodbye Pork Pie. Goodbye Pork Pie is a famous New Zealand movie that came out in 1981 and I've never actually seen it, but I'm planning to go and see it next month. Auckland City puts on some pretty cool free events over summer and one of them's called Movies and Parks and this year they're showing 12 movies in four different parks around Auckland. And Goodbye Pork Pie is on at 7pm on the 3rd of March in Greyland Park, if you happen to live in Auckland. In the scene we're studying today, three people are in a car that they've stolen, which I know because I read some of the plot summary on Wikipedia, and the driver is worried because there's a police car behind them, and he's worried that the police know that they've stolen the car. He says, Get down, they're onto us. To be on to someone means to have found out about some secret bad thing that someone's doing. But the other guy says, Cut it out, Jerry. They're not even looking at us. Cut it out is something that you say to someone when you want to stop them doing or saying something annoying. It's something that a parent might say to their kids when the kids are arguing. Cut it out. Then later, the guy in the passenger seat says, may as well pull over. Pull over means to stop the car on the side of the road. May as well or might as well is a common idiom. I use it a lot. To do something because it seems best in the situation that you're in, although you may not really want to do it. In this situation, the guy says may as well pull over because the police are behind them and he thinks that there's no way they can escape. Kia ora in sick news today, the 52nd Grammy Awards were held on Sunday night in California. The Grammys are an annual award ceremony for the music industry. This year, Beyonce won six awards, including the award for Song of the Year for a song called Single Ladies. And that was Stick News for Tuesday the 2nd of February. Kia ora. Today's word is goon. Goon is an old-fashioned word for a fool. In today's conversation, the guy says, You have crashed a red light, you goon. And in my dictionary, it says that there's another meaning, chiefly North American, a bully or thug, especially a member of an armed force. I don't remember ever hearing the word goon used that way before. How about you? Do you use the word goon? Here's one now. Get down. They're on to us. They are. They're looking at us. Shit. He's turned his lights on. Cut it out, Jerry. They're not even looking at us. They're looking at us now. You've crashed a red light, you goon. Watch the road, you crazy prick. That's because they'll have checked the plates by now. May as well pull over. To move to the side of the road in order to stop or let something pass. A. Pull ahead of somebody something. B. Pull in. C. Pull something off. D. Pull out. E. Pull over. Pull over. To move away from the side of the road, etc. Pull out. To succeed in doing something difficult. Pull something off. To move to the side of the road or to the place mentioned and stop. Pull in. To move in front of somebody something. Pull ahead of somebody something. And that was The Daily English Show. See you tomorrow. Bye.